Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of Moto Unboxing on this beautiful Saturday in New York City. Today, we got something super, super exciting that I'm very much looking forward to. This right here is a Godox Magic X-T1, and it's a wireless mic system for your camera. I've been looking forward to a wireless mic system uh, to be able to capture the more of an ASMR, if you will, of my motorcycle experience. So that way I can mic up my exhaust, my engine, and also experiment with dual vlogging and other things as far as the motorcycle uh, channel is concerned. So when Godox gave me an opportunity to check this out, I happily agreed. Uh, one of the beautiful things about this is that this unit comes in at almost a quarter of the price, at about $100 versus the options from Rode or DJI. But let's unbox it, let's check it out and see what's going on. And right away I will tell you that I'm not some sort of an audiophile, so if you're looking for mega extensive, detailed, like crazy review, you probably can click on a million other reviews from people who focus on sound. This here is a motorcycle channel, but this will still be exciting and handy. So let's see what's in the box. This company has been around since 1993, and they uh, entered the space through creating all sorts of uh, light, uh, lighting solutions for cameras, but then eventually they got into microphones and power solutions. So let's open it up and see what's inside. Boop. And we are greeted with a nice little pouch here. And over here, we got obviously a quick startup guide. And we got some instructions. Adorable. We will set this aside for now. And on the back, it explains a couple of simple things. But we will go through a bunch of it shortly. So first of all, let's see what's inside this little tiny container. Boop. Before we get to the meat and potatoes of the matter, let's see what kind of accessories we got. So we got a nice little USB-C to a 3.5 millimeter here. Then we got 3.5 to 3.5 jacks. Then we also got a data cable for charging and connecting it to your computer. Uh, USB-C is the way to charge this baby. Then we got a couple of magnets for the, for the mics. And we also got a little hot shoe connection for your camera, adorable. So let's set all this aside for now and open up the main part, boom. I know, I'm teasing you, I'm not getting to the mic until last. These right here are uh, little covers, wind covers for the mics, adorable. And these are your little lavalier clips with magnets on them. So that way you can attach it to wherever it is you're attaching it to. And now let's get to the main part, this right here. This right here is your actual receiver and these back here are your two little mics. But first, let's unwrap it. Here is our unit, here is our mic. Check this out, there's a little button here that opens up the little door. And these right here are your microphones, look. Look how teeny it is. It's teeny, teeny weeny. Let's, and they're magnetic as well. They just magnetize to the back. So let's turn it on and see what's going on. So we hold this for three seconds. The light turns on and we're gonna go with English. This is a touch screen and I believe, so this is language setting. This is your okay button. And there we go. We are connected. We are charged. It's important to remember that the unit, the battery in the unit actually lasts for 16 hours, this thing, because this is actually a charging uh, block for the mics as well. And the mics last for eight hours and it takes about two hours to charge the whole situation. So supposedly, as soon as you pull out this mic from the charging station, there we go. Right away, it's paired up. Beautiful. So, and when you put it back, it unpairs and goes back to charging. So there we go. There's mic number one, there's mic number two. So we hold the little button to turn it on. Boom. Uh, it's interesting, they're magnetic, they push each other apart. Uh, another beautiful thing, see, right away, right away it's registering that they're connected. And another beautiful thing about this is that the range is about 
200 meters, which is, you know, plenty damn far, as long as you are have a direct line of sight. And obviously, as soon as you start breaking the line of sight, um, that's, uh, that's when you run into issues. But this will be super interesting for dual vlogging, for giving a mic to a friend who's perhaps riding right ahead of you. And I'm curious if there will be enough um, signal to uh, capture that, as well as miking up my uh, motorcycle. So let's see, let's see. This right here is the mic part, obviously. And these, I guess, could go like that. Ooh, what do we got? Ooh, we got like, oh, we had like little plastic covers on the mics. Interesting. There we go. We had little plastic on. Oh my goodness, this is adorable. Look how cute. Look how cute. Adorable little things. I just, just can't get over the size and adorability of this. Look, boop, boop. And so there is three different recording modes. There's, um, there's stereo, there's mono, and then there is the safety track. Basically, you can uh, have one of these mics run at uh, minus six decibels to uh, get rid of some of the background noise. And also there is a noise reduction uh, system. So these right here is how you go through your settings. You tap on the screen. Yeah, so we're gonna do mono. So basically that means each mic is doing its own thing, which is what we're gonna do. And that's a beautiful thing. So, looks like they probably need some charging. So let's put this down, put this down. See, as soon as you put them in here, they are charging again. Boop. There's a little button here. Uh, the whole unit feels really solid. It's like super light, but it's also like some sort of a plastic metal hybrid. This is your charging port over here. This is your uh, line out and headphone in so you can monitor as you are recording. But this right here is what I'm gonna use to hopefully connect to a GoPro or a phone to record my external sound. And here we go. So let's try it again. Once I pull off this mic, it should technically turn on and start recording right away and it sure does beautiful all right so let's get on the bike and test this baby out and see what the magic is about all right ladies and gents and now it's time to test the mic in the real world let's see if you can hear me as i'm walking away towards my bike i already did a test of the microphone under my seat Alright, so now we have mic'd up the helmet with this mic. So let's see if you can hear the exhaust and my voice at the same time. Can you hear me? Is that yap to you, my friend? And then I did a test of this microphone uh, in my backpack while I'm riding. As you can hear, that's the results. I think the dBs that come out of my exhaust are a little too high for the mic to handle. Uh, that's why the sound is distorted. However, this mic makes videos like this incredibly easier. In the past, I would have to uh, record on that on uh, that camera and then take the sound from my GoPro and splice them. But now everything can happen in one place so i'm actually really impressed with this thing and like i said the price point is ridiculous compared to road and dgi which are over four times the price so i can definitely recommend this mic and i'm looking forward to experimenting with it in a few different ways with my friends on the rides and such and such but for now uh if you are interested click on the link below and get yours thank you so much for watching